Warning, the following video contains MLP related content. It also contains at least one or more of the following. Cursing, violence, immature jokes, funny reactions, or verbal and not safe for wear content. If you do not wish to view anything that may contain any of these, please immediately go to your previous page. Otherwise, stick around and enjoy the show. Hello everyone, Burning Mouse 44 here, and I am back for another pair of reactions. This time around, we are continuing the Mentally Advanced series. We are still doing the negative episode, so we're up to negative three. Um... Man, uh... I'm not, like, 100% on board with the Mentally Advanced series like I was, uh, when I was originally, when I originally found it and Friendship with Witchcraft back when it was, like, really new, but, like, I don't know, like, ne negative one didn't do, like, a huge amount for me, but negative two definitely was, uh, more interesting, it had more humor to it, so, I don't know, if... If it ends up making that kind of progress for each episode, then I still think that this would be a series worth checking out, which is why I'm checking out episode 3 and episode 4. Or negative 3, negative 4. You know what I mean. But, um, yeah, so I don't know, uh, what episode this is gonna focus on, so we should go ahead and take that out. So let's do so in 3, 2, 1, go! to parody. Oh, man, Gilda. It has been so long since we hung out, oh, and two weeks is a out. while to be in okay. Ponyville. It's kind of a backwater little town, isn't it? Everyone is boring, except for like eight or ten ponies. Holy shit, I they got a lot of pizza. I spend most of it napping, and it gets canceled when it rains. Or that is, you know, I just go home. I mean, as soon as it rains, the job is done. What the hey, fuck are you doing? What are you doing? Helping That's me unpack. Asked. Dash, leave my suitcase alone. It will be easy enough to unpack on my own. I'll say. All you got in here is a toothbrush and... Oh, well, you see, that is, um... Pajamas? Ah, yes. Certainly an apparel for the more <coughs> pleasant of evenings. It's a little something I picked up in the Griffin country for the trip here. What? Do you like it? They look like a pirate eye patch. <laughs> yes, of course. That's, uh, that's why I bought it. For the absurdity value. We all have plenty of laughs. Cool. So, anyway, Did you just boop, I guess Gilda? I'll just go ahead and sleep on the couch while you're here. You're the guest, so you can have my bed. Oh, that's great, Dash. But hey, you remember old times. You don't have to sleep on the couch. We're friends. The best of friends. We could both take the bed. No. Um, I mean, <laughs> if you want to share the bed, I guess I don't care. It would be quite comfortable. No, it's fine. They don't want to be just... Kyoto doesn't want to just be friends. Foreign. Uh, then again, it is fine. We can decide later. Well, see, I've developed a really bad habit of kicking while I sleep, so... I can just prepare the couch. It's, it's a cloud futon. I guess we'll just have to tire you out so you don't have the energy for kicking. Ha <laughs> uh, yeah, man. I haven't done a good race in like forever. Ponyville is a slow city. Everybody <laughs> looks like that's not what I mean. Go for a race? I would enjoy that immensely, but you know, I am quite tired from my trip. Aw, you got me all excited for nothing. Sorry, Dash. But uh, how about instead of a race, we do something else relaxing, but still quite engaging. You want to watch the Wonder Bolts on TV? Ah, maybe some other time. Oh, well, that's good, because I haven't paid my cable bill, and also they won't run cable to my cloud house. Wait, why would you get billed if they won't even run a cable to your house? It's a small town, so you pretty much get screwed on cable. What? But, um, also things that I do not have, plumbing is a big one. If you need to go to the bathroom, you can shower, but there's no water treatment line connected, so you've got to go to an outhouse below. Just let me know when you're ready, and I'll show you where it is. Then this may not be a big deal because it's pretty She's warm. She's got a weird house, month, huh? But the cloud walls are not really good for insulation. I couldn't afford the magic insulation, so if you get cold and need extra blankets, I've got some. And of course, there's a big thunderstorm scheduled for Thursday. My house isn't waterproof. I, I couldn't afford the magic proof for that either. So we'll have to move the whole house out of town for a few hours. Dash, this is all stuff you neglected to mention when you said I could stay with you. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, God, I guess I got excited. Maybe I could stay at a hotel for a while. No, no, it's okay. I can do all the no, fishing. No, no, you it's okay. Just it's watch. Okay. I am sure a better breakfast could not cost too much around here. Oh, come on. You don't want to stay with me? I don't know. Please. Dash, when I was doing this, you know what that means, right? You want to do cigarettes? You shouldn't smoke, Gilda. That's not good for She you. wants to be in bed with you. Unless, unless you're being cool. I mean, I've done that once, but, uh, it, like, I was too cool to do it twice. Be honest. Are you just trying to help me save face here, Dash? What do you mean? No, I, I did I did cigarettes. I'm just wondering if I made a fool of myself. <laughs> Ruby Dash is so dumb. And apparently is still out on that. Are you mad because you're going to have to help me move my house? I thought you said I didn't have to do that. You don't. But you're going to be really upset if I don't. Yeah. 
You don't have to. Fine, Dash. Fine. It's fine. Aw. Thank you, Gilda. I promise I'll make Man, it up. She's so dumb in here. Tell you what. Here's how you can make it up to me. How about the massage? A massage? Sure. And, my patience willing, we can work our way up from there. I massage you? Yes. I mean, I could massage you. She's got claws. Are going, I do not see that becoming a reward for me this time around. Okay, gotcha. Ready? Go ahead. <laughs> Ash, stop. What's the matter? Your hooves look as soft as marshmallows, but they feel like bricks. What kind of massage are you planning here anyway? Oh, sorry. I, I just thought that since you were a big, tough griffin that I was going to have to give you a big, tough massage. You know, extra hard. D gently, Dash. Like a cat kneading upon the bed. Okay. She just bang on her like a drum. Rainbow Dash, I have come for your head. Yes. Surrender immediately and I will slay you without quarrel. What? Who is that? Oh, that's my good friend Pinkie Pie. She really likes to be around other ponies. You cannot hide from Pinkie. Yes. She knows your birthday, social security number, and place of residence. She sounds angry. I gave her all that information because she's really good at birthday parties. Also a bit for medical records. But we should probably just leave her alone until she gets bored. You probably shouldn't give her the she social. she got like this and I went out to meet her, she threw a rock. Uh, I am not putting up this. It will be a moment, Dash. Oh, shit. A few- a, a moment, it's a you few know, hours later. I remembered you being pretty cool, Gilda. But it turns out you're just a great big fat butt to poor innocent never did anything wrong Pinkie Pie. Yes. You are a dick. And we are content to do without dicks. Fine. You are all imbeciles anyway, and at this moment, I will be- He's <laughs> like flipping them off. Hello, Rhonda. It's Gilda. No, things did not go so well. I'm headed home early. I know. I know. I know what you said. But really, I remember her being twice as smart and three times prettier. Well, you were right. As consolation, how about dinner? Yes, I'm treating you. Okay, I'll pick you up tomorrow night. Go to the player. <laughs> what the fuck? I don't know. They. Uh, I feel like there could have been more potential for that for this particular episode, but like they they dragged on a little bit too much, I think, and they didn't like expand or like change scenes or whatever. Uh, soon enough, so I feel like it just dragged on a little bit. So, to be honest, I did not like that episode. Uh, the first two were actually better than the third one, so, which kind of stinks because, uh, like I said before I started watching this, that, uh, it looked like it might be getting better as they go on. Like, the first one wasn't terrible, wasn't bad, the second one was better, and I was like, oh, cool, so it's gonna get better and better and better. No. Well, to be fair, the actual show doesn't actually get better with every single episode. It has its highs and lows and some, like, in-betweens and stuff. So, I guess that's to be expected with uh, fan projects, too, to be fair. So, I won't hold that against them too much or anything like that. But, nevertheless, I still said I was going to take a look at Negative 4 as well. So, we're going to do that right now. Uh, the preview thumbnail that I have from when I got the file, has a picture of Rarity, so it's going to be a Rarity episode, I'm guessing? Not sure which one it's going to be on, though, so I guess we'll find out. In three, two, one, go! So what are we all gathered around for? Did this crowd just form spontaneously? I don't know. I don't really recall how I got here, but I'm in the front of the crowd, and that makes me happy. This seems to happen a lot with social situations. I think we're all waiting on the Trixie Shield. Trixie. A fireworks sale. Two for one, although it's a bit early for Hearthstone. So that's a Trixie episode. Do we have to be here? I want to go home. Why? The only thing waiting at home for you is chores. I found and a bit laying on the ground. I'm going to put it in my bed and I'm going to sleep on it. Spike, give me that. You don't know where it's been. It's dirty. But it's mine. I found it. Welcome, everybody, so much money. to the great, the powerful Trixie Shoe. Show. Oh shoot, did I write that? Um, what the fuck is this I place? am the great and powerful Trixie. My name is spelled with an X, actually. I think when I made that banner I was a little drunk. I was gonna change my name for marketing, but 
Never mind. Behold! Hey, what is no this voice? So far. Who said that? How dare you? I'll have you know that an honest critique killed my family. She didn't mean your show sucks. Twilight, it does suck. And so does her outfit, by the way. Oh, oh, she ah! too. This whole town, you guys are all stupid, head up your butt idiots, and I hope you all die. No, no, no. Guys, stop heckling. For once in our damn lives, just let an avoidable conflict pass us by like a drunk weekend. No, see, around here, when kids say you suck, it means they think Why they're great. Why should you What do you think also? I am, an idiot? Like, yeah. as big of an idiot as everybody in this crowd, and everyone is an idiot, and if you say differently, then you're a bigger idiot, and I'm gonna tell everyone else in the town over that you guys are all idiots. No, I mean, look, if you did that, I mean, clearly, you're the victim here, and you'd be in the right, but you know how, like, a long time ago, bad used to mean cool? It's kind of like that. It's what? like one of these insipid generational slang things. Well, that's right. You guys are in the wrong because you're like a whole crowd and you're just ganging up on one person. That's not fair. That's like mob mentality. But I, I didn't know about the suck thing. So I'm really sorry for my outburst. I, I, I guess I'm getting old if I don't know about the slang today. Yeah, it happens to the best of us. So now that we're all friends and we agree that you're great, can you get on and do your little show, darling? Why would you lie? Um... Well, there's not actually a show yet. Then why did you get so upset when we said it sucked? Because I thought you were crushing my dreams before they began. We only do that so you don't waste all your time and wind up disappointed. It's tough love. Except we don't actually care about you, so most <laughs> of us No, hear me out. It's a great plan. I'm gonna do Peter Pan on ice, but I'm gonna crowdsource everything. Did you seriously gather together a bunch of cheap plywood so you could build the stage and tell us this? Did you not realize that you could get drunk at the local bar and do the same thing for less time and energy? I've also got this story about how I wrestled a space bear. Same criticism applies. Just drink a lot and tell the stallions your little story, and eventually, one of them will take you home. Instant gratification with half the work. That shell. Damn! The objective is to spend money to make money, and then get the guys, okay? I'm business oriented. <laughs> if I spend money and skip straight to guys, that's like... Well, that's like missing a crucial, ambitious step. The long-term planning to afford the alimony suit. Yeah, that one. Well, <laughs> I don't really want to settle down with a guy. I just want the money. The alimony suit. I mean, and a guy occasionally, but I don't want to settle down with him. Ugh, I know what you mean. You know, I run a boutique myself. Really? I tried to take up sewing. I Why are all the other ponies still here at this point? I could come by. Well, that would be great. We should make a date out of it. If you've got a few bits, I could really spruce up your outfit with some gaudy rhinestones. Is the show done? Oh, yeah. Kinda. It hasn't started! Because there is not. Sorry I called you guys idiots. So, can you put money in my hat and help crowdfund my project? Otherwise, no, I don't have any bits. Oh. Well, I sure hope someone gives you some money. So you can afford my <laughs> Twilight's gonna give Spike's bit. Skills. Twilight, give her some money. You give her your money. It's to pay for my tailoring. It's for a good cause. I'm not gonna pay your dumbass for her tailoring. Then you're paying for <laughs> it's like a chariot. What do I get for this? Do, get for this? <sighs> do you like Ponit? You like Ponit. No. I'll hook you up no. with Ponit. He's, he's not my type. He's a pretty boy. Well, he's the sensitive type. Maybe he'd be up for certain things. You could try pegging. I'll do what do. I tell you he's not my type. He's not my type. Dr. Forget... Horse, then. Forget the dating thing. But it's Dr. Horse. Come he's on. He's married. Married. So? Put money in the hat, please. Fine. I've got a bit. Hey, that's my bit. I knew it. <laughs> four-legged thieves, you can't do this. Hey, <laughs> four-legged thieves? I did not realize how racist Ponyville was towards ponies. You wouldn't expect that from the name. Would you stop doing that? You, you can't put yourself. You can't generalize the entire thing for one like person. Hive mind. I tell you what. I tell you what. I will pretend to be mollified to avoid conflict with you racist guys. But later, I'm going to go on my blog and I'm going to tell everyone that Ponyville sucks. How is that a bargain? You know, actually, I don't care. I bet your blog sucks. I bet nobody follows. Well, maybe y'all should just go before this blows up. Okay, AJ, I'm gonna go, but just, you know, before... Fine. You know, it, you, the rest of you enjoy... <laughs> Spice flipping them off. Unless... You, I'm going. Because I want to, not because you told me. <laughs> what I learned today is... It's not the friends you make, but the friends you keep. Nope, you already did that one. Okay, then you suggest something. <laughs> Eat Princess Celestia. Today I learned there's nothing wrong with a bisexual Eat a fling dick. that blows off tension. Eat a dick. Can <laughs> you ever figure out what this key goes to? Nay, I don't what? know what that key belongs to. Well, I'll just put it somewhere safe. I'm tired of seeing it laying around. Hey, hubby, you look at your friends differently after a bisexual Eat fling. Eat a dick. What? She's not gonna read Eat it. A dick, I Why is it she keep saying that? <laughs> Instead of just saying, no, your idea is terrible, you just keep saying, eat a dick. <laughs>
What the hell? Um, like, the first one I didn't really think was that big of a parody, other than the fact that, like, they didn't go talk to the other ponies, they just stuck with the first two that, you know, won the tickets. But it was pretty much like the same mechanic there, uh, but, like, I feel like the overall concept of it kind of changed a little bit more for the future episodes, which is kind of good, because that's something that I prefer, like... Like, when I first got into, like, fan projects and, like, watching those kinds of things, uh, like, the original uh, Friendship with Witchcraft kind of thing, like, I liked those um, most when they completely went off of the main topic of what the original episode was supposed to be. Like, I don't think it's that interesting when it's trying to cling to what the original was and only have, like, a little wiggle room to make its own originality. But when you actually have as much originality with it as possible, I just think that just comes up with a better video overall. So, ah, uh, huh. I thought that this one was supposed to be a rarity episode because it had, because when I got the thing, it had rarity's face on the thumbnail for me. But, uh, apparently it really wasn't. It was more of a Twilight and Tr Trixie episode. Uh, for that one, so... Hey, whatever works, I guess. But, I don't know. I, I thought it was pretty interesting. Uh, fucking Trixie's voice, though, like... Oh my gosh, Trixie's voice is wacky. Trixie's voice is just something. Something, alright. <laughs> oh god. Uh... How many more episodes in this series is there left that's already been released? I think there's like three. Yeah, we still got five, or negative five, negative six, and negative seven. I gotta make sure I say the word negative because otherwise I'm talking about like the other versions. Ah, my eye! Alright. So we still got three more of these to take a look at, but that's gonna happen later on. I think that's gonna wrap up my... Uh, thoughts on these episodes everybody and so if you enjoyed these videos at least have as much as I did then leave a like down below and if you have not done so already because why would you not then uh you can click up here in order to subscribe and that will you up to date on the content I make in near future because I intend to update this stuff fairly frequently and perhaps you'll miss out so without further ado this is Brennan Mouse 44 saying see you guys later